partners, welcome to the Worst Possible Commander Show. Today we get the pleasure of showing off some rowdy commanders from Outlaws of Thunder Junction. A tip of the hat to Wizards of the Coast for giving us early access to these exciting new cards. Our Rule Zero conversation is all about the worst possible thing our decks can do to each other. Now let's meet the crew. Howdy y'all, it's me at CGB and today in this here arena commander game thing we're doing, I'm playing Gonti Canny Inquisitor. Gonti Canny Inquisitor is a 5 mana 5-5 five five, and spells you cast but don't own cost one less to cast. Whenever one or more creatures you control deal combat damage to a player, look at the top card of that player's library, then exile it face down, as in steal it. And I may play that card for as long as it remains exiled and mana of any type can be spent to cast it. My plan is to use unblockable creatures, sneak into your homes in the night, and steal all of your stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> I like my stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna be that reckless rogue who steals your stuff and smirks at you while doing it. I'll use unblockable creatures like Triton's Shore Stalker and Changeling Outcast to steal cards from my opponents with Gonti, then I'm gonna cast them for cheap. If that wasn't enough, I'll use Villainous Wealth or Outrageous Robbery to steal huge chunks of some unlucky outlaw's library all at once. Howdy y'all, I'm Blake, and I'm gonna be protecting my lands with Yuma, Proud Protector. Yuma, Proud Protector is an eight mana 6-6 six, six human ranger. This spell costs one less to cast for each land card in my graveyard. Whenever Yuma, Proud Protector enters the battlefield or attacks, you may sacrifice a land. If you do, draw a card. Whenever a desert card is put into your graveyard from anywhere, create a 4-2 green plant warrior creature token with reach. The worst possible thing my deck's gonna do is just your classic lands tokens with a desert sub theme and I'm gonna use them to kill you. Why did it have to be lands? I love lands. Oh, he sure does. My plan is to protect this land. Using ramp cards and enchantments like exploration and artifacts like Crucible of Worlds, I will keep the deserts coming and going from my graveyard to make tons of plant warriors. Other payoffs like Omnath Locus of Rage, Scoot Swarm, and Avenger of Zendikar will let my opponents know to stay off my land. Hello, I'm Ben. I'm here for rootin' tootin' good time. Today I'm gonna sacrifice my little critters to our cool the unprecedent to get my big boys out of my hand. <laughs> Not the big boys! Not the big boys! <laughs> A cool the owner of pen is a four mana five five scorpion demon row with flying and trample. Sacrifice three other creatures. I may put a creature card from my hand onto the battlefield, activate only as a sorcery and only once per turn. My what's possible is using token makers like Bitter Blossom, Hoarding Outburst, and Siege Gang Commander. I will make expendable lackeys to sacrifice to my commander, allowing him to put giant monsters like Razaketh the Foul Blooded and Grave Titan onto the battlefield. It gets worse. I can use mass threatened effects like Insurrection and Mob Rule to steal my opponent's creatures and sacrifice those creatures to my commander. That is, if I just don't win on the spot first. Hey y'all, I'm Shay, and today I'm going to be committing all kinds of crimes with Ariette the Beguiler. Ariette the Beguiler is a 4 mana 4-4 four, four creature with lifelink. She has a static ability that reads, whenever an aura you control becomes attached to a non-land permanent and opponent controls with mana value less than or equal to that aura's mana value, gain control of that permanent for as long as that aura is attached to it. And the worst possible thing I'm gonna do is cast sweet, sweet aura spells, targeting your creatures, stealing them, and then murdering you with them. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> so do you like your magic cards? Well, I like them too, and I'm here to steal them. Using auras like Angelic Destiny and Unquestioned Authority, I'll enchant everyone else's creatures and take control of them. On top of that, I can shift into Voltron mode by putting all that glitters and ethereal armor on my Beguiling Lifelinker and take out the table with commander damage. Thank you to the sponsors of this video, CoolStuffInc.com and Ultimate Guard. Shay won the die rolls, so let's dive in and let the quick draw and showdown nonsense begin. All right, I'll start us off. Draw for turn. We'll play an island and pass. Draw for turn. Tapped Hinterland Harbor, go. Draw. 
I'm gonna play a tapped bristling backwood, and I'm gonna deal one damage to CGB. <laughs> Starting it out right. <laughs> what? So wow. desert that taps for red or green, and when I was battlefield, I do one damage to CGB, is what it says. Pew pew. Uh, I don't know if you know, but that is a crime. Oh, you I just know all about. Crime I know all about committing crimes. Wow. And it's gonna be Ben's turn. Howdy, partner. I'm gonna draw for turn. <laughs> One sentence. Play this beautiful swamp and pay it. That's How long is he gonna keep it up? I'll draw for turn. Forever, I reckon. <laughs> oh my goodness! I didn't. Ex we didn't. I didn't no. know this was coming. No, I didn't either. I didn't either. <laughs> oh, it's gone. Plains as my land for turn. Then I'll pay two for a Felwar stone and pass the CGB. Quality card. Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Undergrowth Stadium, and how about Arcane Signet? Your turn, Blake. All right, I'm gonna untap, draw, I will play a Spire Garden, and I'm gonna cast a Nature's Lore. I'm playing lands again. <laughs> you sure are. Love it! If there's one thing he knows, it's ramp and ramp. <laughs> <laughs> There's only two things in life I love. Go ahead, Ben. What are you <laughs> Play a mountain. <laughs> I'll trump your arcane slayer and raise you a Felwar stone. <laughs> you play is Felwar stone a raise? He's play is he playing that one it is. At best what? it's a call. Is he playing euchre or poker? I can't tell. <laughs> I don't know. You know pants. Oh, all right, Ben. I'll untap. Draw. Play a prairie stream. Untapped. When you'd like the... Oh, I got you. Paying four for my commander, Ariet, the Beguiler. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> thank, you, thank you, thank you. It's already happening, guys. <laughs> Don't put out anything you wouldn't want beguiled. <laughs> uh, then I'll pass the CGB. Untap, draw for turn. I'll cast a Tower Winder. This 1-1 one, one snake has reach and death touch, and when it enters the battlefield, you search your library and or graveyard for a card named Command Tower, <laughs> reveal it, put it into your hand, uh, and if you search this way, shuffle. It just so happens I built my deck with a Command Tower in it. Good choice. Mm, Only know. one, though? Good thinking. Only one. <laughs> That'll be my land for turn. After that, I'm done. I will untap, draw for turn. Hmm. Probably good later. What? He looked right at me. <laughs> he's thinking about if he's. It going don't to matter lose. either way. <laughs> I'll spend three for a tireless tracker, and then I'm gonna play a Ramanop Ruins. Who's gonna make a clue? Go ahead, Ben. Untap, draw. Draws. Haunted Ridge. <laughs> Akul the Unrepentant. So, right now you don't have any creatures. Right. So it's not very scary. Right. Yes. Get it, Shay. <laughs> Get it, yeah, yeah, steal it. It costs four. Yeah. Don't you dare steal it. Noted. That. Noted. Dude. We're gonna have trouble if you steal it. Go ahead. <laughs> Hey guys, shoot me shot gallery. <laughs> I'll untap and draw. I'll play a watery grave as my land for turn, tapped. I'll pay three for Danatha, Compassion, Paragon. First strike, Vigilance, Life Link, Aura, and Equipment spells you cast cost one less. Okay, she, she chooses peace in our current time. Oh, peace in goodness. our current time, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, but I got a 4-4 four, four lifelinker I can swing with. Blake, I'm attacking you with Ariette. <laughs> well, no. I, that's the only good attack for it, to be fair. <laughs> that's <Yeah>. fine. <laughs> I'll take four. All right. It won't be forgot. And I will gain four. And that's commander damage. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> As they said in the old <laughs> ones. <laughs> Yeet. <laughs> <laughs> Pass the CGB. Untight, upkeep, drawer. Just stop saying drawer. 
Exotic Orchard. Yeah. I, I mean, when you pick up this deck, I <laughs> guess that you have one plan. Let's do it. Out comes Gonti, Canny Acquisitor. Now, whenever one or more of my creatures deal damage to a player, I look at the top card of their library, exile it face down. You don't get to see it. I'm looking at you, Ben, because you're being attacked by Towerwinder. It's a 1-1 one, one death touch. Rude. I'll take it. I bet you have some nice creatures in here, too. I bet not. <laughs> oh, I don't like that face. Oh. I'll just stay right there. Right there till I need it. Pass the turn to Blake. Thanks, Pard. I'll untap. Rowler. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to cast a Magmatic Insight. So as an additional cost spell, I'm going to discard a Maze of If and draw two cards. I'm going to play Straight Up Desert. Nice. That is a card. If I wish I could roll trigger, I will get another clue. I'll cast a Rampant Growth. I got a Plains. I'm going to pay a life to use Ramanop Ruins to cast a Renin 6. Whoa. That's Whoa, what I'm indeed. saying. Oh, well. I will immediately plus Renin 6 to 4 to get my Maze of If back. Oh, Welcome back. I was actually excited about that being gone. You thought I was going to let it go away for long? I hope so. I did also get a Tireless Tracker trigger from my Rampant Growth. And then I'm going to pass to Ben. Untie it. Draw hole. I'm gonna start off the Dockside Extortionist. Ugh. Cool casual Dockside. <laughs> yeah. That's three for me. I got one. one. Five treasures. Looks like I struck gold with those five treasures from Dockside. Then I'll tap two and play Orgage Bowmaster. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my. Pew pew. <laughs> What's getting pewed on that yeah. one, my friend? Who's getting the you treatment? You get a one one orc army and a one pew. One pew. To any target, including Dan. Red and six. <laughs> You're gonna one shot it with your commander. Okay, well. That is true. See, I feel like in a Western, I would be like the prospecting crazy old gold yeah, right. kind of guy. The guy with like the beard. Oh, I'll sacrifice all five treasures. To play Siege Gang Commander. Oh my lord. I wrangled three goblins with the Siege <laughs> Gang entering. I'm gonna activate my commander's ability, sacrificing those three goblins. You just wrangled them up to murder them? Sure did. And play a Rune Scarred Demon. No! Oh my god. When he enters the battlefield, I'll search my library for a card and put it in my hand. Okay, I got a card. Well, I'll put it in my hand. Wow. Wow. Your old Ren and Six is safe this turn. Shay, you got the most <gasps> life. Five damage coming at you. Wow. In the air trample, commander. Okay. okay. No blocks for me, I'll take five. Are you gonna take that disrespect? We'll see. Uh, go ahead, Shay. Okay, I'll untap. Ben, you're having a little too much fun over there. I am not. <laughs> you know, I I get a little jealous sometimes. Get a little jelly? So, I'm going to go ahead and pay three. It's reduced by one. Casting Eidolon of countless battles for its bestow cost. I am going to target your commander. Rootin' tootin' tarnation. <laughs> uh, and so... <laughs> Then once it becomes attached, it'll get plus one, plus one for each creature I control and plus one, plus one for each aura I control. The young commander steal, bro. Wow. That is some serious crime that I just witnessed. Treason. <laughs> <laughs> so you're going to respond or you're going to wow. pass it over? Unless you guys want to help me, huh? No. Mm, no. Not, yeah, I don't this, think so. This cowboy got no friends. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ben. Thank I'd call you. you more of a lone ranger. But, uh, but wait, now how big is that thing? So plus one, plus one for each creature. One, two, three, and plus one, plus one for each aura. So right now that's a nine, nine? All right, then I will pay two, again, reduced by one, uh, unquestioned authority. 
Uh, so when it comes into play, I will draw a card. And I'm gonna target your Orcish Bowmasters, Ben. Well, rootin' tootin'. <laughs> You lose a couple more creatures, all that's gonna be left is a tumbleweed. I know. I saw one on my way here today. <laughs> I guess Shay's the law in these parts. Yeah, I guess so. Unquestioned. Can we get out of this that town? Ain't big enough for the both of us. Is your orcus bowmaster sheriff? Oh, thank you, thank you. Then I will play a glacial fortress untapped as my land for turn. Moving to combat, Blake. I'm gonna send my commander. To your planeswalker. Even though it's all the way on the other side of the board. Even though it's all the way over there. You can't hide from me. You must have ridden a horse over here. All right. Bye. And I'll gain four life. And uh, I think I'm done with crime, so I'll pass to CGB. I think the scary threat has changed. Uh, this is a, an ever-changing game we play. Yeah. Untap, upkeep, and draw. Now and then I just have to ask myself, which of these here libraries do y'all think has the most lands in them? <laughs> hmm, I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Reliquary Tower. And we cast Oblivion Sower. When I cast this spell, target opponent exiles the top four of their library, and I may put any land cards that you own from exile onto the battlefield under my control. Why, Blake? You like lands? Uh, how many you got in there, Blake? 43. 43 lands in your deck? Yeah. Well, let's see what we got here. We got Bosagio, <laughs> Desert of the Fervent, <laughs> uh, Rumble. No! <laughs> Give it back! Aftermath Analyst. Give it back. Uh, <laughs> They're exiled. I can't help you no more. Unbelievable. <laughs> Wincon gone. <laughs> Shoot. Those will enter the battlefield under my control. Desert being tapped. Move to combat. I will attack Blake with Gonti, the canny acquisitor, because I'm trying to steal more cards. And I'll attack Ben with the 1-1 one, one Death Touch Tower Winder. I don't like how you're using that 1-1 one, one to attack. <laughs> I, that, I, 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 I'm uncomfortable with it too. I just really want, I want to steal some cards a lot. Uh, no blocks. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna block it. If you block it, that's one less thing that you can use with your commander when you get it back. That if you get it back. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, fine, I won't block. That was easy. He's got gaslit. <laughs> Wow, I didn't One expect that to work. <laughs> okay. Now I know how it works with Ben. You don't want to do that. Okay. May it be terrible. It's something. <laughs> Pass the turn to Blake. All right, I'm gonna untap. After that travesty, draw for turn. This game's about to become a runaway train. See what I did there? Because that's like really the best turn. A runaway train never coming back? Going nowhere. Wrong way, on a one-way track. Feels like it might be getting somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Did you say Tampa? Yeah, that's in the south. <laughs> okay, bring forth the train. Natural Choo -choo, order, sacrificing my tireless tracker. Wait, what? Natural order. Natural order? Yes. And you sacked your tracker? Well, I couldn't sack a clue. I'm really glad you exiled the top four of my deck and then the fifth one, because that drew me right to the natural order. I got Omnath Locus of Rage with it. I'm looking out for it. I appreciate you. I'm gonna spend two and I'm gonna crack a clue. Uh, when you draw a card, I have an Orcish Bowmaster's trigger. He's getting bowed. <laughs> no, no, come on, come on. Don't, Jay, you yes. wanna steal this snake. I can tell, you would rather steal this snake than kill it, I can I tell. I would love to, but I'm gonna shoot it. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> You're gonna target the snake? Yeah, I'm gonna target the snake with the, the Bowmaster the trigger. Target Shay? my snake. How, what's the crime count from Shay? <laughs> it's, it's a lot of crime. It's, it's a, lot a lot of crime. Of crime. Yeah, yeah, that resolves. Cool, and I will amass one. I'll play Maze of Ith as my land for turn. Trigger Omnath. Oh, he looks just like him. It's like his son. Yeah. Yeah, just like him. 
All right, on that, I'm going to pass to Ben. Untap. Draw. I'm going to tap four and play Elemental Mastery, which is an aura, onto my Rune Scarred Demon. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. What, what does that do? So this enchanted creature has tap create X11 one, one red elemental creature tokens with haste, where X is this creature's power, and I exile them at the end. So. Wow. That would be really good with your commander. It was. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> Rune Tune Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tap Mountain Doom and pay one life in the Felwar Stone to activate Siege Gang Commander's ability, sacrificing the Dock side to do two damage to any target, which will be Danatha. <gasps> uh, yeah, that happens. She will die. Okay, your turn. I still don't. Oh, no attacks. He's holding up the token making. Wait, let me test this. Let me test if this is a real thing. <laughs> Wait, Please, you second. don't need the hat to test it. Well, how- It's a little heavy for that. Sup, mother- <laughs> Yeah, there you like go. Okay. Well, you don't say that, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't you seen a Western? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I think you're confusing Western and Chicago gangster. Oh, sh- I, I do that all the yeah. time. <laughs> all right, I'll untap. I'll play a Meticulous Archive as my land for turn. It'll enter tapped and I will surveil one. I will put Lotho, cor- Corrupt Sheriff, into the graveyard. Then I'll pay four for a Smothering Tithe. Oh, everybody's favorite Shay. Whoa! <laughs> Everybody kill the Shay. <laughs> I'm gonna move to combat. I've been doing crime all night. Might as well just continue. <laughs> this is the life continue. she chose. Continue. <laughs> I heard that too, continue. Ben, I'm attacking uh. you with oh. your own commander for 11 flying trample. The treachery. <laughs> hey, Ben. What? How much oh. do you like me? Wait. What did I do there? <laughs> I, I don't know, Forrest. <laughs> Stupid is a stupid does over here. How much do you like me? Uh, no, I'm not. I don't know. I kind of like this. It's kind of funny. Which part? Ben getting bonked by his own computer. Are you saving me? There's nothing. There's nothing about politics that doesn't that you can't entertain offers from Ben. I'll take. I mean, I'll take an offer if he's got an offer. But what's his offer? I'm not gonna attack you for a turn. Boring. So handsome, like. <laughs> I'll type Mazzy Mazzy. Oh, no you gotta offer me something better oh, yeah. than just um, a compliment. You, Cause you love me, right? <laughs> I'll pass, I'll pass priority. <laughs> oh, no bailout plan here, oh, rancher. Man, okay. You better come back with a better deal next turn. I'll try. I'm gonna take 11. I'm not gonna block. That will be 11 of your own commander. <laughs> yep. Jeez. We better keep track of that. Yeah. <laughs> Just in case. She's out here with the two shot. That's yeah. crazy. All right. I'll pass. Oh, yeah. Let's do it. Untap. I love evil Shay. It's the best. Upkeep draw. I am not paying your tithes, Shay. The West needs to stay free. <laughs> well, I'll just, uh, I found some gold. Yeah, you're going to get gold. <laughs> well, Shay, I'll do my part for the coalition of those against Shay's tyranny, and I will attack you with both of my creatures. <gasps> okay. I will block your commander with the bowmaster. I will not block the other one. That's five points of damage. Yep, I'll take five. And if you'll do me the favor of exiling the top card of your library face down and pass him right over here. We get jealous, I don't know. I know. I know. That's why reveals are so cool. Mm-hmm. Indeed. Underground River. I'm gonna cast this card called Heartless Conscription. This is a eight mana sorcery. Exile all creatures. 
For each card exiled this way, you may play that card for as long as it remains exiled, and mana of any type can be spent to cast that spell. Exile this card. What? I've never seen that card. It is a very bad card. It, too. It's a card. Yeah. It's a new card. And Bonkers. it's all, so it's not targeting. That's right. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Shit. Bad, do you have any responses? No response. I would like to respond by casting a Teferi's Protection. No! <laughs> <sighs> She got the law on her side too. <laughs> She's got it all. She got him on her side. You were trying to get back my commander for me, and now I, was I trying. can't have it. I was trying. <laughs> no. I was trying. Well, yeah, that sucks. <laughs> that does suck. That really sucks. Yeah, get out of here. Get out of oh, here. Geez. It's a lot more peaceful where they're gone. Though. Yeah. Am I right? This is my from exile pile that I made. And kind of my second hand as well Based that up. I got cooking. Yeah. Based yep, yep, yep. Ah, <laughs> I think this I think this is three sheriffs versus one criminal. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're right. I'm gonna pass uh, actually you know what this calls for? This calls for a team up. Yeah. <laughs> the three bandits against the law. <laughs> so, Blake, your turn. Right. We can just forget that thing I did that exiled all your <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if you're the kind of people I want to be working with. I don't think you got choice in this matter. I think you might be right. Draw a turn. I'm going to start by paying two to sack a clue. Draw a card. I'm going to cast a Farseek. I got a Temple Garden. And there's tapped. I'm gonna pay us. Okay. Untap, draw. Tap five for a ghoul caller, Gisa. Yep. Another fun way to make zombies for your commander, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Go ahead, Shay. Uh, at the end of your turn, I will sack my clue. I knew it. I knew it was just sandbagging that clue. <laughs> you gotta be cool with it, you know what I mean? Speaking of cool with it. No. I'm back. She's sick with it. Untap. Draw. You said it wrong. Draw. <laughs> <laughs> Paying four for Archon of the Wild Rose. Other creatures you control that are enchanted by auras you control have base power and toughness 4-4 four, four, and have flying. Okay. It's not that bad yet. It's a little bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The Bowmasters is now a 4-4 four, four flyer. And then <laughs> That's I not bad. <laughs> not bad. And then I think this is a net neutral because it goes down to 4-4, four, four, but I just played a creature, which gives it an additional 1-1. One, one. Then I will pay three for a Ristic Study. <laughs> also a card that is good. <laughs> it just gets worse. <laughs> you've got the, yeah, you've got the Holy Trinity, oh, Smothering yeah. Tithe, Ristic Study, Teferi's Protection. Mm -hmm. Now, Blake, <laughs> is there any chance? Almost assuredly not. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> is there any way we could work out a deal where you don't maze of it the creature that I send to Ben. You mean my creature? His commander, <laughs> yeah. I can't do that in good conscience. Mm -hmm. I thought you might say that. I knew I had a partner. <laughs> <laughs> All right, moving to combat. I'm gonna send Ben's commander to Ben. I will send Ariette to Blake and my orcish bowmaster to CGB. No blocks here. <clears throat> I will. Maze of it, Ari No, I'm gonna Maze of it, the uh, Ben's commander. Whew, close call, Thank right? You. Yeah, I took four for that. Well, I've got something then, too. Ooh. I'm gonna cast this nice, friendly path to exile out of exile. <gasps> Flavorful. And I'm gonna take out the Archeon of the Wild Rose. Ah, shoot. I will not pay for Ristic, though. Okay. 
I will draw. Now we'll go search for a basic. All right, I grabbed a planes and a lantern tapped. I will take one from the Orcish Bowmaster. And, and I will take four, Black Link. Now we'll gain four. I'll pass the CGB. Untap, upkeep draw, no. <laughs> Not paying your tithes. <laughs> West must be free. <laughs> Going to play Ben's Mountain as my land for a turn. <laughs> then I'm going to cast my commander, Gonti, and I am going to pay for Ristic on this one, Shay. Okay. Four more mana. I'm going to play Hostage Taker. I'm not paying for Ristic on this one. I am going to target Akula, the other uh, uh, Ben's commander. <laughs> <laughs> So, Ben, you get the choice, assuming this resolves, Shay. It resolves. Ben, you get the choice. Is this going under the hostage taker or is it going to your hand? Now, I feel, I feel like we have a common enemy. We do. I feel like we can make a deal. Indeed. I feel like if you want to attack me with that there, Gisa, I might be inclined to block with this here hostage taker. So your commander goes straight back to that battlefield. You got yourself a deal, sir. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That was so fast. <laughs> Kept your ideas, all right. Ben's commander has been taken hostage. <gasps> Ooh. By the ally, not the enemy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> My bestow enchantment now becomes a creature. Yeah, and I'm kind of scared of it, but go ahead, Blake. Yeah. You gonna untap? Drawer. <laughs> <laughs> gonna tap three. Paying for Ristic Study. Mm. Gonna cast a Bitter Reunion. Uh, when I was battlefield, I may discard a card. If I do draw two cards, I'll discard a mountain and draw two. <gasps> okay, you're drawing cards, smothering tithe triggers. Also on your draw step, it did. <laughs> sure. So that's three treasures? Sure. I'm up to four treasures. That's also gonna be uh, some orcish bowmaster triggers. Blake, what are you doing? I gotta play the game, dude. <laughs> I gotta play the game. <laughs> Uh, so my orcs army will amass twice. And then I've got two instances of 1-1 one, one damage to direct. Uh, CGB, Yo. your life total. Ow. Take two, please. <laughs> you got it. This guy brought a bow to a gunfight. <laughs> <laughs> Tap Sacred Foundry. The time's come, Shay. Your reckoning is upon you. Hmm. I'm gonna pay three, paying for Ristic Study. I'm gonna Bovine Intervention your commander. <gasps> this is destroy target artifact or creature. Its controller creates a 2 2 white ox creature token. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Shoot. Okay, yeah, that resolves. Ox. You're the proud owner of a new ox. Great. Did Always wanted yeah. one of those. I hope you don't spend it all in one place. And then I'll pass to Ben. I'll untap, draw for turn. Smothering tie trigger. Would you like to pay two? I'm gonna pay two. Wow. New year, new Ben. I, I don't know if that makes me happy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's it's shut him. It's yeah. shut him. If he can do something else, he probably should. Yeah, yeah for sure. CGB. But could we restructure our deal slightly? Well, I reckon we could. Okay. You'll attack me on my turn instead of me attacking you. Oh, so you don't have to attack with the uh, ghoul caller right now. Yes. Uh, if I'm able to do that, you know, if the hostage taker makes it that far, uh, I will do that. Sweet. I will tap three for a rattleback apothecary. Death touch three, two. Whenever you commit a crime, target creature you control gains your choice of menace or lifelink until end of turn. Cool. All right, I will draw for the Rhystic Study. Arch Nemesis, your turn. <laughs> All right, I'll untap. I'll pay two for an Arcane Signet. Would you like to pay the, oh yeah, you control that. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Then I will pay six to cast Ariette. She back. I'm gonna send Eidolon to CGB and the Ox and the Orc Army to Blake. My own ox? I just traded it with you. Yeah, but the, the trade wasn't too good for me. You even had sound effects for it. <laughs> that wasn't me, that was the ox. Oh, okay. 
<laughs> so this is sus because I'll definitely block with the hostage taker. But Ben, I'm telling you right now, there's nothing I can do if she's doing this because she has another aura and is oh, gonna no. steal it again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a good point there. So, don't uh, use the don't use the ghoul collar. Don't use the ghoul collar until you're sure she's not stealing this, yeah, okay? That's fair, that's fair. All right, I am blocking the idol on with hostage taker. I'm going to remove your army from combat. Okay. So that'll just leave a 2-2 ox coming at you. I will not block. Damage? Hostage taker will die, Ben. Here comes your commander. Ooh. Yeah, he's, he's back. I will crack four treasures. <laughs> Sus. <laughs> <laughs> to cast Sarah's Embrace. <laughs> targeting? Or, targeting Ben's commander. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, Woo. poor Ben. Thank you for the advice, CGB. <laughs> Aren't you glad you didn't pay the one? Yes. I'll pay one life, though, and a black mana mm -hmm. to activate the ghoul caller to sacrifice my commander to make five two two zombies shoot uh, fizzles no embrace for you maybe next time <laughs> <laughs> maybe next time all right i'm done over to cgb yep on tab draw for turn smothering tide no I'm gonna cast five in any combination of colors, because that's how casting this stuff from Exile apparently works. And I will play Endrek Sahir. Classic Western name. Master Breeder. <laughs> this is a five mana two two. Whenever I cast a creature spell, create X one one black thrall creature tokens, where X is that spell's mana value. If I control seven or more thralls, I sacrifice this. Are right, you gonna say Master Breeder was your nickname in high school? <laughs> sure as shit not. Sure as shit not. <laughs> Land for turn. Going to pay for the Rhystic Study and get a one mana reduction thanks to Gonti. I'm gonna cast Oblivion Sower. Does anybody have any lands in exile? Nope. Lands in nope. exile? Lands in exile. Nope. Ah, oh, well, then I guess I just gotta go with my gut and target Blake again. You're the lands deck. How much are you hitting me for? Four. Exile your top four. Okay, one, two, three. <gasps> oh no! Oh. Cliff! All right, well, bye oh. to your cards, I guess. I guess. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> that sucked. <laughs> yeah, you're telling me. <laughs> However, I will make six thralls. And because I have a ton of blockers now, I'm gonna attack Blake for five commander because I need more cards. And hopefully you got a land down there for me now. All right, I promise you there could be. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh, nice. Oh. Perfect. Oh. It's either a land or a sword to plow shanks. <laughs> All right, your turn, partner. I'm gonna untap, draw for turn. CGB, do you just keep milling me to sick cards? Uh, when you draw, Smothering Tithe. Nope. I'm gonna play a Scavenger Grounds. I'm gonna spend eight paying for Ristic Study to finally cast Yuma, Proud Protector. <laughs> uh, when there's battlefield or attacks, I may sacrifice a land. If I do, draw a card. I'm gonna sacrifice Desert. And so this guy says, whenever a Desert card is put into your graveyard from anywhere, create a 4-2 plant with Reach. Whoa. And I got just the plant. There he is. So this dude goes out in deserts like destroys the desert and somehow creates a plant warrior that I don't can know. block he, flyers. He's also <laughs> holding like the West version of Baby Yoda. Oh God, no! no I'm no, not even no, joking. No, Look at that not, card. Oh God, no! Not more Baby Yodas. <laughs> There's one thing we didn't need. Well, it's what we got. Well, now I'm gonna draw from Yuma. Smothering tide. <laughs> And Smother bone. your stupid tithes, dude. Great. Also, an Orcish Bowmaster's trigger. <laughs> I will amass Orcs one. I'm playing my own game. And I've got a damage to shoot. CGB, your face. My face? Yeah. Well, All the these plan. thralls were just here for it. Yep, your uh, face. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Go ahead, Ben. Okay. Untap. Draw for turn. Smothering Tithe. Have a treasure. Sweet. Dig that gold. 
I'm gonna tap six to get a cool back. Whoa. A cool, a cool. How does it feel to have your commander in your game of commander? <sighs> Finally. <laughs> Before you celebrate, let me be the one to ask. Risk six study? <laughs> no. You have a land open, Ben. You can't do this every time. I'll draw off the Rhystic study. I'm gonna activate my commander's ability, sacrificing three zombies. Going on to two. What's it do? And I'll put a creature from my hand onto the battlefield, which is Razaka. The foul blood in it. More that's, tutors. That's been in your hand since the Runescar demon. It has, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Well. Maybe we should just thank Shay for taking it away from him. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Hey, now. And I'm gonna pass a turn. Whoa. All right, I'll untap. Paying four, I'll cast a Johnny's Chosen. Whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control, create a 2-2 white cat creature token. If that enchantment is an aura, you may attach it to the token. Ben. What? what? This town ain't big enough for the two of us. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna pay four and cast four. Take Flight. Not targeting four. your commander. Again. Again. <laughs> I think there's a love triangle going over yeah. there with the cool. I think I, Shay just wanted to play Rakdos this game. Mm -hmm, we'll never mm -hmm. know. <laughs> oh, we know. <laughs> I'm gonna tap Mountain Doom, pay one to activate Ghoul, ghoul Caller again to get five more zombies. Mm -hmm. Shoot. I guess you got it off the board. All right, I'll pay three to cast Gift of Orzova. Uh, and I would like to target Eidolon with this one to give it plus one, plus one flying and lifelink. And that's gonna be an Ajani's Chosen trigger. So I'll make a cat. There's my tutu cat. Moving to combat. CGB. Yo. Swinging on you with 10 10 in the air lifelink. Now, Park, come sit at the table with me. <laughs> we got some discussing to do. Uh, Would you like a glass of whiskey? Ah, uh, I don't usually drink with vermin like you, but I find myself in a predicament. <gasps> you sure need to learn how to t negotiate better. <laughs> you can't ask me to have manners. Might as well ask a scorpion not be a scorpion. <laughs> Uh, so oh. for the low, low cost of you not attacking me for five or anything to get your stupid card, I'll protect you from this damage. No attacks? Nothing at me. Yeah, deal, partner. I can't believe you call me vermin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna maze a bit of Shay's dumb thing that's being mean. Oh, shoot. <laughs> All right. Thought I was the dumb thing being mean. <laughs> <laughs> but that's more of an emotional pain than a life total pain. <laughs> They're different. Pass to CGB. All right. I will untap. Draw for turn. Smothering tithe. Not pain. Sometimes you just gotta see what happens. Not pain for Ristic. Or in Frostfang. Oh. <laughs> Attacking creatures I control have death touch. Whenever a creature I control deals combat damage to a player, I draw a card. Uh, okay, I'll draw. That'll trigger the Master Breeder, and I will make five more Thrall tokens, and then I will sacrifice the Master Breeder, because that's just too many. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's your card for your graveyard. Dang, that would have been a really good card in Ben's deck. <laughs> shame. <laughs> it's a crying shame. Play Blake's Forest. It was a land. Nice. Casting Runescar Demon from Exile for six. Not paying. I'll draw. I'm gonna search my library for a card. Move to combat. Shay? Yeah. Get you some. <laughs> <laughs> it's all coming at you. It's a lot of death touch. Green Square Demon is eight. Nope. Yeah, I was, I was <laughs> okay. Good nice. catch, good that was catch. Sure doesn't. Mm. I want that blocker anyway. <laughs> yeah, there you go. So that's six throws, the Oblivion, Sower, and Gonti. That is. I will block the Oblivion with the Ox and Gonti with the Cat. 
And let the thralls through. Correct. Damage. Mm -hmm. All those triggers on the stack? Yep. I have a response before they go off. So there's a Gonti trigger, and then there's six draw triggers from Orin Frostfang. Okay. I'm going to cast a Deadly Rollick. I'm going to pay the one. I'm going to target the Orcish Bowmasters. No! Nice. Okay. Good play. Uh, yeah, that happens. All right. Then Bowmasters is exiled. The two two twos die. I will draw six cards, and you will make six treasures. And I will exile the top card of your library face down. That's mine. I will move to end step and discard absolutely nothing because of Reliquary Tower. So have a good turn, Blake. I'm gonna try. Gonna untap. Draw for turn. No. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> I'm gonna spend two, and I'm gonna cycle a Desert of the Indomitable. So I'll draw a card. And I will make a 4-2 Plant Dude. Smothering Jive? All you. Cool. Oh, I'm gonna pay for Ristic Study when I cast this card. And I'm gonna cast a Titania Protector of Argoth. So when this enters the battlefield, I put a land from my graveyard into my hand. Which is... Oh. That's what that card. All right, that's a card that did that thing. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, I'm gonna go to combat. CGB. Yo. You did a lot of stuff. I got a lot of thralls. You did a lot of things. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna hit you for a very friendly. <laughs> Six. When that attacks, I'm going to trigger Yuma to sacrifice Scavenger Grounds. This is gonna do a couple things. It's going to create a five-three elemental and a four-two plant warrior. Oh, that's value. So, so, for our little showdown, tell me about your commander stats. He's a 6-6. Six, six. A 6-6, six, six, you say? You got that trample? He don't. You got that death touch? He don't. <laughs> you got that hexproof? He don't. You got that indestructible? He don't. <laughs> but I got a maze of it. I block it with this here thrall. <laughs> one of my one of my five thralls. Oh, I forgot you had those. That is okay. Uh, yeah, thrall dies. Great play. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna pass to Bayon. Uh, untap. Draw for turn. Some other untap. Yeah, shelf a treasure. Yeehaw! I'm gonna pay two life and sacrifice a zombie. I'll get that for you. Search. Oh, thanks, partner. Card. I got a card. I'm gonna do it again. This can't be a good sign for the for the team, can it? What team? You just attacked me. <laughs> <laughs> you attacked me like six turns previous. I didn't last turn. I honored the deal. I full send it at the enemy. I hate the enemy. I did what I could. You did, you did. I did. Let me show you scoundrels how the West is won with this card here. Insurrection. Oh, oh that's not good. That's a problem. I, um, but. Shay? That's our Shay. Shay? Our blue man. Shay? Do anything with that pile of treasures? Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't think you can pay for Ristic. Oh, get him! <laughs> Come on, Shay. Get. Come on, Shay. Come on! I will draw off the Ristic study. That didn't look like that. It. That's, that's, that looks bad. <laughs> it looks oh, bad. No. He's not good. Um, I'll pass. You pass priority? I'll pass priority. I will also pass priority. And I'm gonna do the same. Oh, let me check these exile cards. Oh, yeah, look. Oh, nope, nothing there. <laughs> Let me take all the cards from my deck and just please save us. So, uh, um, so Ben, let it? me be the first to congratulate you on your new thrall army. Give complete me a great with an Eldrazi. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm declaring attackers. I've separated them into piles against each of my opponents. I got four to five damage coming at CGB. I got. <laughs> 27 coming at Blakey boy over here. <laughs> yeah. And I got a whopping 
53 coming at the dastardly, devilish, <laughs> treacherous Shay. Mm. <laughs> All right. Attacking y'all and your dastardly plans. <laughs> I think our dastardly plans got interrupted. Yeah, yeah. Here's the one oh, with the dastardly man. plan. Oh my gosh. We had this from the start. Wow. Well, I can see that there's enough damage pointed at CGB and Blake to get around the maze of it. Mm-hmm. But Blake. Yeah. My dear friend. Yeah. Would you consider using the maze of it to save yours truly? <laughs> let me think on that. When, let me just. <laughs> 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 That's gonna be a no oh, for me. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> As a matter of fact. I'm gonna stop CGB from taking four damage. This gets you nothing in the next game. I just want you to know that. Then I take it back. <laughs> <laughs> this town ain't big enough for the four of us. Oh! Oh my god. Hey. Man, what a sick end, dude. Give it up. Oh, that was man. so cool. The king Ooh. of the West. Rune Tootin. <laughs>Sure was one hell of a rodeo. Sometimes you get and sometimes you get got. Ben took the game to another level by casting Dockside, Orcish Bowmasters, and Siege Gang Commander, then cheating out a Rune Scar Demon with his commander, all in the same turn. Shay put Ben back in his place by stealing his commander right out from under his nose, along with his Orcish Bowmasters. CGB tried to even the playing field with a board wipe, but Shay put herself firmly in the lead with Teferi's protection boys had to work together to keep her under control, but Ben was plotting a killer insurrection in the background, and all he had to do was manipulate CGB into giving him back his commander. After that, Razakaz snuck onto the battlefield and set up the victory. The cool stuff in card of the game is Ghoul Caller Gissa. Having a sack outlet on board let Ben protect his commander from Ariette's beguiling ways and it gave him the creatures he needed to sacrifice to his commander and Razaketh to stir up an insurrection for the win. Use the promo code WORSE when you shop on CoolStuffInc.com to support the show. This has been the worst possible commander show with potentially the worst possible accents. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next week for another game of Commander. On behalf of the Covert Go crew, Thank you for watching this video, and as always, we'll see you in the next video. Yippee-ki-yay, and you're cool. To be so hot like this. <laughs> Why should being so hot like this? <laughs> the new country cover. How could she be so hot like this? <laughs> <laughs> she thinks my tractor sexy. <laughs> Isn't that a song? That's a song. Probably. I've yeah, run some things. You're not wrong. wrong. Wow, wow really? Not it's wrong. Just, yeah. <laughs> Country songs, man. It really turns me on. <laughs> <laughs>